Welcome to this video tutorial from CoreTechnologies.com. Today, we are going to show you how to run the award-winning LiveDrive cloud storage application 24-7 as a Windows service with Always Up. Once we are done, LiveDrive will automatically start to back up your important files as soon as your PC boots without any need to log on. Let's get started. First, install and configure the LiveDrive desktop client from LiveDrive.com if necessary. Please make a note of where you installed it, as this will be used in a later step. Next, if you haven't already done so, download and install Always Up from CoreTechnologies.com. Next, start Always Up and select Application Add to open the Add Application window. In the Application field, enter the full path to the LiveDrive executable LiveDrive.xa. If you installed LiveDrive in the default location, this is C colon backslash program files backslash LiveDrive backslash LiveDrive.xa. In the name field, enter the name that you will call your application in Always Up. We have specified LiveDrive, but you can specify another name if you'd like. Click over to the Logon tab and enter the username and password of the account in which you installed and configured LiveDrive. LiveDrive must run in this account so that it can find its settings. Click over to the Startup tab and check the Ensure that the Windows Networking Components have started box. This informs Always Up that LiveDrive needs the network to do its work. We are now done configuring Always Up, so click the Save button to record the settings. In a couple of seconds, an application called LiveDrive will show up in the Always Up window. It is not yet running though. Now before we start LiveDrive as a Windows service, we must stop any existing instance. If LiveDrive is already running, close it by right-clicking on the tray icon and selecting Exit. To start LiveDrive from Always Up, choose Application Start LiveDrive. The state should transition to running after a few seconds, and LiveDrive will be working in the background. Note, on Windows 8, 7, Vista and Server 2012 and 2008, LiveDrive's tray icon won't be visible. This is because LiveDrive is running in the isolated session 0 and can no longer interact with your desktop. If you wish to see the LiveDrive icon and manage it normally, Choose Application Restart Live Drive in this session to have Always Up Restart Live Drive and make it available on your desktop. And finally, since Live Drive is now being started by Always Up, there is no need for it to try to start again when you log on. Using a Windows Startup Manager like the free Auto Runs utility available from Microsoft, find the Auto Start entry for Live Drive and disable it. That's it. Next time your server boots, LiveDrive will start up immediately without anyone needing to log on. Please restart your PC now and test that LiveDrive works as expected after Windows reboots. We encourage you to edit LiveDrive in Always Up and check out the many other settings that may be appropriate for your environment. For example, send an email alert if LiveDrive stops, configure a daily restart to clear memory leaks and much more. Thank you for watching.